Holy shit. That looks fucking mean, eh, bro? Straight in the next shoot. So he's down in this tree somewhere. Well, just nailed a ball. Um, yeah, across the other side there. Pretty, uh, pretty awesome to be honest. Hopefully he's, uh, hopefully he's a big boy. He looks pretty good in the, in the camera and spotter. So um, yeah, hopefully we'll uh, get some tape measure on tomorrow. But uh, yeah, he's stuff in there. So a bit of a mission on in the morning to go and get him. So it's too late to go over now. So we'll uh, yeah endeavour to get up, shoot over tomorrow morning, have a look, and see if we can uh, recover him. Sweet. Oh well, just got back to camp. <clears throat> the keys are sounding almighty guilty, but it uh, doesn't seem to be anything that's been touched, which is good. So, yeah. We'll um, sit down, have a feed, and a couple of beers, and think about uh, our retrieval tomorrow. Hopefully the weather stays like it is, and um, yeah, we'll be able to crack on with, uh, with another one tomorrow, and hopefully Gav can get one on the deck. It'd be bloody awesome. Right up, cheers. Yeah, morning team. Well, had a bit of a sleep in this morning. Our kids were up pretty much all night. Don't know why, but yeah, they were uh, making a hell of a racket. So we're awake a lot during the night. Um, yeah, so just had some brekkie. Just going to head off. Um, see if we recover this ball. 
last night when we were walking back we heard um, heard a shot from Vin and Nick they're camping upstream so hopefully they've got a good ball as well um, so we might cross paths with them this afternoon when we try and recover my one so um, yeah look forward to it hopefully it's a good one and um, yeah we'll touch base when we get there and show you the goods if we can find them All right. Oh, someone's got a story to tell. Mine's a hissing man. Good shit. Work it. Awesome. <laughs> Whew. How's those legs? Yep, burning. <laughs> Good yeah. man. Got us a stick out. Uh, finally found him, didn't take very long, we walked past him actually, we thought we could smell bull tar, but um, yeah, he's right down in this, this gut down here. It's in a shit of a spot to get out, but we'll get in there and get him out and see what he looks like. Stoked to find him. Absolutely epic. Fucking <laughs> Yeah, so... Uh, Found this guy managed to drag him out of the out of the filthy west coast scrub. Um, he fell right in a real shitty little spot to, to drag him out of, but uh, no, it's good to finally catch up with him after shooting him last night. Um, beautiful animal, cracking cape and uh, coat on him. So we'll uh, endeavour to whip the head off and skin him out and uh, we'll find Gav one this afternoon. Looking good. Cheers, guys. This is the sort of shit you keep yourself out, show the missus. solo mission and Gav, um, Gav was lined up on a ball just across from camp so we just heard a couple of shots so hopefully he's got it on the deck. Um, yeah I'm just going to head away, it looks like the weather's closing in for the next couple of days so um, yeah it might be a last chance to get in for a hunt before we spend uh, one or two days in the tent so you're yeah, not looking forward to that but that's all part of it. Um, yeah so I'm going to head across the river now and hopefully get in a position where uh, 
there will be some animals tonight and hopefully get a better one on the deck. All right, we'll touch base again later. Star hunting, they said. It'll be fun, they said. <laughs> Having a great time. Here we go. Well, just going on 18 hours we've been in the tent for. Um, yeah, it's just not living up out there. Uh, pretty stoked we got this new tent. It's keeping me uh, keeping me pretty dry. There's a wee bit of condensation inside, but it's to be expected after being in there for this long. Um, it's keeping the weather out, which is the main thing. Yeah, just sort of contemplating having something to eat. It's, I'm not sure, but because I, I don't really want to have to get up and go for a crack in this weather. If my wet weather gets soaked. I really don't want to get wet again after being dry. Um, yeah, it's meant to last until well after lunch tomorrow too, so we'll just have to play it by ear. And I'd say we'll be pretty stir crazy after two days in the tent. Uh, hopefully James can come and get us in the, in the machine tomorrow and we can get out of here because uh, there's certainly no point being here because we can't hunt. So. Packed up, guys. That's us for the uh, 2019 tar rut. Um, weather's been diabolical for the last two days, so we rang up to try and get an early pickup um, this morning. And of course, the weather's turned out bloody mint. But uh, yes, we're all packed up. The boys have already gone on the first load, uh, Vin and, um, and Nick. So yeah, uh, not quite the, the size of bulls we were hoping for in this block which is a bit unfortunate. A lot of younger bulls, sort of you know, between the 10 and 12 inch mark, we only really saw one really cracking bull and he was uh, in an impossible spot. So the chopper guys have been in culling. Um, yeah, numerous piles of gut bags around, which has made life easy. Everything's pretty gun shy. Um, yeah, anyway, that's the way it goes. It's all packed up, so we'll be back to, um, to Fox shortly. And uh, yeah. Beer and lunch at the pub, and those of you on the project, right up.